Yeah, I thought I had a bottle of yikes. <laughs> <laughs> Jake P with the I'm Not Sober Drink Review and today on the docket I'm going to do it a little different man. I'm representing the Rattlers right now. You know I went to FAMU. If you didn't know, now you know. Got this Rattler shirt. Go to jakepeople.com for it if you want a cup. But I'm doing something since we talk about historically black colleges. Let's talk about a black liquor brand. It's called LS. It's cream liqueur. I seen this on the Breakfast Club now. It says it's inspired by one of the most iconic beverages of the Pearl of Caribbean known as creams. LS cream liquor is a rich blend of fresh cream and island spices that eludes, um, well, excuse me, exudes style and luxury while staying true to the exotic heritage. Now, um, don't know very much about it. I do know it's 17% alcohol by volume, and that black bottle is dope. I don't know if I've seen a like pyramid scheme type bottle before, but hey, I'm gonna tell you, I got this for like 15 bucks at Sam's Club, so I got a good deal on it. So I said, man, I, I might as well try. Hey, see what it's about. Throw on my film you shirt. We represent the day. You feel me? So. I'm gonna put it on some ice because I think it'll taste good on ice. So, without further ado, let's get it cracking. Now, it does have the twist off uh, top. Oh man, the top is uh, poorly built. So, I don't like that at all. <sighs> My people, we gotta we got tighten up, man. You don't supposed to just be able to pull the top off like this. You gotta tighten up. Uh, but, without further ado, we still gonna taste this thing. So, let's get it chilled up. <laughs> I'll treat it like, uh, I don't know how I'm treating it. I guess I'll treat it like that. And I'll give it a little spin. Now, with the cream liquor, I just wanted to get cold. All right. I'm going to give it a true taste. Y'all didn't see me taste it there, but I'm going I'm to give it a true taste. So, here we go. There's a variety of spices in this, right? But it it's a good it's a good base cream, but the spices take me take me quite a few places. Let me give it one more sip before I tell y'all where it takes. I'm getting like um it's crazy. I get like a little pepper pepperminty, then I get an almond flavor taste in there. It's um it's a crazy experience wrapped up in some goodness, if, if you get what I'm saying. Like, it's just, it is a rich blend of uh, spices, but I don't know how to put my thumb on it. But let me try to put my tongue on it one more time and tell y'all. I had some great cream liquors, and I think I'm just falling in love with cream liquors because... Everyone I've come across has been tasting very good. Uh, this one's a very good one as well. It's not flavored. It does have the spices in it. So, um, of the cream liquors I had, I think the Di Serrano cream is probably one of the best. Right behind um, uh, Blue Cherry Bay, the banana. And then, you know, the rum chata. It was getting kind of old to me, but it's still a solid, solid pick. This right here is right up there with them. I mean... It's for a lower price too. The price point of those is like 25, 30 bucks. This is $10 cheaper. So that makes it that much better. I mean, the design of the bottle is dope. I didn't like the top. I can't really put, you see the top is not all that. They need to work on that. But a solid thumbs up. Don't forget to like and subscribe. This is Jay Fever. Yes, sir.